guys, it's Hockey Bros. Welcome to another jersey unboxing video. I think it's been a few years since I've done one of these. Uh, today, we have probably what's going to be a vintage jersey. Um, this is from the defunct, inactive, relocated, whatever you want to call it, Arizona Coyotes. I got this off of eBay from Full Moon Jerseys for around $40. Can't go wrong, so we're going to open it up and check it out. All right, here it is. So this is, I think, one of, this is probably the only away jersey that I have in my collection now. And uh, half of it's here in Colorado, as you can see a few behind me, and half of my collection's in California. So here's the jersey. It is a Reebok large Arizona Coyotes jersey. So it looks like we got a little bit of a a little bit of a fold in the crest, but that's all right. Uh, and I know I said Arizona Coyotes, but it does have the Phoenix patch on it. So it was before they changed the name. So technically when they made this jersey, they were still the Phoenix Coyotes. And yeah, guys, I like it. It's about time to add a white jersey to my collection. I like the, how it has the strings too. And it's a beautiful crest. You know, I like the Kachina, but not gonna lie, it was pretty clean look when they were using this. So I'm gonna throw it on and we'll see how it looks. So there we are guys, the away jersey for the Phoenix Arizona Coyotes. It's nice, this is a probably almost a 10 year old jersey now and it still has the tags on it, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, shout out to Full Moon Jerseys on eBay, check them out. They've got almost all the teams in the NHL, anything and lots of uh, Reebok jerseys and good deals that you should be able to find in your price range. Um, the main thing that really motivated me to, to buy this jersey at this point was just because of all the things happening with the Arizona Coyotes uh, and the U new Utah hockey team. It made me feel very nostalgic about them and I just wanted to send them off well by getting a brand new jersey. Um, I have experience with the Coyotes. You know, Unlike when the Thrashers moved to Winnipeg, I wasn't really watching hockey in 2011. I had no connection to the city of Atlanta or Winnipeg. Uh, but in this case, it hits a little closer to home being from Southern California. I went to a Ducks and Coyotes game in Arizona, and I actually really liked the arena when they played at Gila River Arena. The fan base was pretty good. Um, despite it not being sold out, there were very passionate fans there. Um, and so it just kind of hurts to, to see the team go. Uh, obviously, I wanted it to work out in Arizona. Um, but I also have experience um, traveling and visiting Salt Lake City. It's a beautiful city, definitely fits as a hockey market, and so I think that they're gonna do well there. Uh, but obviously it sucks seeing it be at the expense of the Arizona fans. Uh, but anyway, guys, leave your comments down below if you have any questions, love to be able to answer them. But again, I got this from Full Moon Jerseys on eBay, so go check them out. And yeah, what jersey do you think I should buy next if I'm in the market? Thanks guys for watching, and that's how you get an Arizona Coyotes jersey. Hockey bro style. See you guys in the next one.